My name is Lauren Heidinger, and I designed the burlap and copper necklace for Ice Sanctuary. I'm 22 years old, and I'm a junior here at the Savannah College of Art and Design, also known as SCAD, um, in Savannah, Georgia, and my major is jewelry and objects. When I first heard about the Ice Sanctuary contest, I was taking both Studio 2 and a rendering class. Um, and I was a little apprehensive at first about entering because, you know, I wanted to have a really good idea and to make sure it was thorough and I wasn't sure if I would have the time to like come up with an idea that I really liked and was good and strong. Um, so I like let myself mull it over for a little while and think about it. And I decided after learning more about the company, like I thought it was a really great opportunity and it would be so cool to be a part of. So I decided to come up with something that I really liked and um, I submitted it just to see what would happen. And I mean, great news, <laughs> I won, so yeah. Because the contest was announced in a couple different classes, um, it was not a requirement for me in my classes. I know it was for some others, um, but I chose to do it. One of the main reasons I decided to participate in the competition was because I was really excited um, about what Ice Sanctuary was all about. I thought it was so cool. Um, what they do for the victims of human trafficking and how they like find ways to give them a job um, that you know it teaches them a skill and it lets them work with other people and it gets them back into the world and I thought it would be so cool to like be a part of that if I could so that was the main driving force as to why I decided to design something for the competition. I also thought it would be really cool to um, find a way to mesh my own like style with that of Ice Sanctuaries. Um, so it was kind of like a design challenge. Um, so I, you know, I really like earthy, natural objects and metal obviously is a naturally occurring object. And something I thought that would be really cool and really different is trying to find a way to use burlap, which obviously is not something that you see much in jewelry. Um, so I decided to kind of make like a burlap sandwich in between two pieces of copper and from there I just kind of designed. My inspiration for the necklace didn't come from an actual object or thing um, but more of the idea of I really like to mix opposites kind of like hard and soft, geometric and organic. Um, and I really, like, one of my favorite things to do is kind of find ways to repeat a basic geometric shape and, like, find different ways to rearrange it and make it, you know, look cool. And so with the series of squares, I decided to put a nice, like, planish texture on top so it was nice and organic and, like, curvy and none of it was really all the same looking so there was a difference throughout the surfaces. Um, so I kind of, like, the top of the squares were nice and soft looking, but the outer edges were nice and hard and rigid. And then when you put it on the body, it looks really nice because it lays well, um, and it adds, like, with those ridges, it adds a nice, like, texture and different ways for the light to bounce off of it. And honestly, it would, it look good with anything. <laughs> I'm so thrilled and honored and excited to play a small part in what Ice Sanctuary does for the victims of human trafficking. I thank you so much Ice Sanctuary for giving me this amazing opportunity and thank you for watching. <laughs>